and we forget that every choice my friends is an opportunity to explore the unknown it is a sadhana every choice that i make every single moment of my life is not really a choice i'm making is a sadhana tapasya preparation i am doing i am preparing the soul of my heart to embrace all the unknowns that there are what is that one thing that we have right now which one goes never comes back huh? a question please write what is that one thing that we all have which one goes never comes back what is that nirav says time akshay says time swati says time yes that's the only thing that we have which once goes never comes back time monica says breath breath is nothing but time monica yeah in the in the indian tradition we say that we have limited breaths we we come here with counted breaths which is nothing but time kala which we call in english kala and breath is deeply related anyway we'll not go into that that's the only thing that we have but because of this this comfort zone we do not encounter and i'm using the word encounter the daily possibilities of this unknown now if i'm not encountering this unknown with these small things of a relationship changing geography changing home changing job etc etc if i'm not encountering these small unknowns because of a certain comfort zone known zone will i ever be ready to face and encounter this big unknown called death will i ever be prepared as rajiv said very beautifully and rightly that we are never prepared for it rajiv the question must be why we are never prepared for it will that preparation happen out of a blue on its own no 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 this life in itself is a phenomenal opportunity for preparation to prepare us for all the unknowns and whenever you enter into the unknown you know yesterday or day before i was talking to a friend and we were talking something similar and i said when you jump from a cliff you don't fall you learn to fly don't try it it's a it's a metaphor <laughs> don't say that you know you said in one of the satsang so i jumped from my third floor and broke few bones huh? it's a metaphor <laughs> and through this metaphor of what i'm trying to say is when you enter into the unknown it's not a blank wall that is what a new beginning something new open up the new doors open up are we together are we together and are we encountering the small unknowns that we experience on daily basis even small unknowns like food we all have you know choice of 10 different dishes or five different dishes and always every day we want to just eat that people from north of india when they migrate to south of india you know all they want to eat is chapati and not adopt to the diet of south of india people who migrate from south of india to north of india and south of india's key food is let's say dosa and sambar in idli when they come to north of india they don't adapt to chapati they want to eat the same food every day we don't even experiment with that as an unknown unless there's a medical issue unless we are pressurized by our doctors to do that on our own we never do that why because just we think we have a choice to choose what we want to eat and we forget that every choice my friends is an opportunity to explore the unknown it is a sadhana every choice that i make every single moment of my life is not really a choice i'm making is a sadhana tapasya preparation i'm doing i'm preparing the soul of my heart to embrace all the unknowns that there are and the beauty is once you enter into that unknown once you start to explore these small unknowns all the unknown starts to become known do you understand i'm saying all the unknowns start to become known because now it is not a linear progression of one unknown second unknown third unknown and so on and so forth you have broken the linear progression now 
you've taken a quantum leap into a space where inside of you you are extremely comfortable rather welcoming the unknown now it does not matter it is the unknown about the geographical location about the food about the job that you will do it does not matter anymore because you entered into the space of unknown within your own self it the linearness stops there <laughs> Thank you.